thirst for the thrilling thrills in Ajiro thickened with trapping tough of tinful lines unleashed from the stable of Adewali Ayuba. <laughs> Ajiro, a tranquil town with tapestry of majesty in Etiosa local government area of Lagos, was on Tuesday, October 23rd, gallanded in glory with a garment of unprecedented glitz that garnished the 25th coronation anniversary of its monarch, Oba Tijani Adetunji Akilui, the Ojumu of Ajiro land. <laughs> The week-long activities marking the 25th anniversary got to a peak on Tuesday, October 23rd, with a colorful and elaborate banquet. <laughs> the conformity of color and concordance of glamour christened the hall with a communicable command of artistic layout. literally walked on its feet and this was made eloquent with the surge of urbane personalities into the comfy arena. The yawn of blue and white Ankara fabrics was truly a unifying force and clear indicator that practically accentuated the extensive spread of the occasion across the center of excellence. Virtually everyone who is in one way or the other connected to the community or the royal circle had to abandon their commitment on that busy day to be part of the royal feat bettered by the 25th years of remarkable reign of Oba Akilui in Ajiran Land. <laughs> The arrival of the monarch slightly altered the temple of the hall as he moved round to acknowledge the presence of his guests. <laughs> the pair of the seasoned TV broadcasters, Toyin Kawujue and Madame Kufu, creatively paddled the affairs of the event and carefully navigated any drab juncture with their comic infusion. The celebrant heartily welcomed his guests to the occasion and expressed his delight on the success of the week-long activities that marked his 25th years on the throne of his forefathers. The chairman of the event, Honorable Ademola Dada, former chairman of Island Club, showered encomiums on Obatijani Akilui for the unparalleled development he had brought to Ajiro. The celebrants thereafter cut the anniversary cake, which consecutively opened the floodgate of photo shoots. Then, the celebration began in full bloom as the celebrants led his royal guests to the dance floor. The Oloris in their numerical order also stepped out on the stage as Bonsue Master brought down the roof with his pulsating melody. Guests had a nice time with an abundant provision of continental dishes and drinks. Talk of eminent personalities 
who have ever come across the monarch in their journey of life, the occasion was made up of them. But their presence was not really surprising, going by the qualities and characters of Obatijani Adetunji Akiluyi. He is a monarch with an endearing disposition that would always make anyone crave to know more of him. In the last 25 years on the royal stool of Ajiro, Oba Akiluyi has saddled himself with the responsibility of providing service to the people, the community and humanity. This is the virtue he has held dearly even before he became the Ojomu of Ajiro Land, a former secondary school teacher who rose through the rank and found to becoming a principal and later the executive secretary of Etiosa Local Government Education Authority, Oba Akiluyi, has in the last 25 years deployed his network of contacts, social influence and technical know-how to transform what used to be a swampy village with deplorable settings into a bustling and commercial center with scenic aquatic splendor. As a renowned educationist, Oba Akiluyi took education, healthcare, and infrastructure as non-negotiable legacies that must be bequeathed to his people. And so far, he has pursued these goals with vigor. Partly explains the infectious joy that reigned supreme on every street of Ajira town as residents trooped out of their blissful mood to celebrate their monarch with magnificence. <laughs> was on the driver's seat of merriment, sending forth the Bonsue Fuji that drew everyone to their feet. Some of his guests spoke to Red Carpet TV. of this land and looking around you will witness that there are a lot of development in the land people are driving the population is getting larger and larger it shows that he is a king that God has blessed for the people and I pray you will live long on the throne of this father is one of the most peaceful in Ajinaran. It, it, it makes a virtually uh, disorganized society which organized into a modern city that is called Ajira of today. It was also able to weld the different people communities together so that Young and old, man and woman, present for mostly in the Nigerian land of today. Everybody is one. Ambassador the second, the Jumu of Ajira. I rejoice with him today on the anniversary of his Silver Jubilee. He was a young man when he came on the throne of his father. And he had what it what it takes to be the king, and he has exhibited the qualities in the past 25 years. Ajino has gone from a small town to a big, developed, modern town. It's not a standoffish. It's not a standoffish oba. It's an oba 
that actually replicates what a Yoruba Oba should be. And I pray that the Almighty will allocate his life on the throne and make him more prosperous. And may his tribe continue to increase. I'm happy to be here today because I was part of the beginning and I'm still part of the Silver Jubilee. And I pray that he will celebrate his Golden Jubilee on the throne of his fathers. Thank From the Red Carpet TV crew, we congratulate Obati Jani Adetunji Akinwe on his 25th coronation anniversary as Ojuwu of Ajiwunna.